Hey guys, it's Rachel here with DNR Apothecary. I wanted to give you guys a, a quick update as to what's going on with the shop. As you can see, we have some soaps labeled. This is what our new labeling is going to look like. It's going to be the, um, the cigar band within the label of what this is. And this is green apple, so pretty green. Coordinates with it. Here we've got some dragon's blood. Isn't that pretty? So these are our new packaging. Over here I wanted to show you a couple soaps. You guys have been asking about a few of these. This is our Bay Rum. Isn't it pretty? This is our Madagascar Spice. Other spices up there. Dandelion Meadow. Besides roses, dandelions are my favorite flower. They smell wonderful. They're, they're misunderstood. I love them. This is wonderful. Uh, here's our Lavender Anise. If you've seen the video of me making this, that pretty. And then our last soap we made for the relaunch is our peppermint. This has um, pumice in it, uh, apricot seeds, walnut shells, and poppy seeds. So it's a great scrub for your hands, your elbows, your knees, your feet. So that's what's going on there. Um, I wanted to show you this last week I was making lip balms. So here we have our 32 different lip balms. I made a chocolate orange truffle and a chocolate raspberry truffle. Chocolate bonbons, but they're all in here. Just got to be labeled. I have the labels made. Just got to print them and put them on. If you're not familiar with doing Bath and Body, the labeling does take a while, but we'll get it before relaunch. There's the rest of them. And I was also able to make some lip tints. Yay! So far I've got five of them. I do want more. I'm expecting a shipment of Micahs any day now. So I'm hoping by relaunch I can have a few more colors. But here's our peach. It's really pretty. Now when we go to list these, I'll have pictures of these on either my lips or my daughter. So you can see what they look like on. Lip tints are not lipsticks. Lip tints just give you a little bit of color. Um, it's nice and sheer. It's not too much. It's perfect for tweens and young ladies. And I wear them as well. I don't wear lipsticks. I think they're gross and thick and yuck. So lip tints are the way to go. There's a pretty silver. A raspberry. A regal purple. I love that. And then over here is our chocolate. And these all have little sparkles in them, and they're beautiful. I love them. I'm very happy with them. And also, started with our roll-on perfumes. A lot of you have bought these from us. They're super popular. When we reopen on May 28th, we're going to have 103 of these different fragrances to choose from. These are great. You stick them in your pocket. Whenever you need a touch-up, there you go. You just put them on. So, I wanted to show you something else we've been working on as well. You see this glitter? Isn't that pretty? You're like, well, what are you doing with this glitter? We are testing glitters for nail polish. That's right. The NR Apothecary is going to be getting into the nail polish market. Um, and we want to test the glitters to make sure they don't bleed. As you can see, I mean, this pink here, the clear is now a pink. The red... That's all red. The black, you can't even see it. So these glitters, I will not be able to use. But that's the fun of testing. I mean, you know, we want to offer you great products and not, you know, I, I sell you a, a blue sequins um, nail polish and within a week it turns to this. You wouldn't be very happy with that. So testing, testing, testing. But this is coming in the very near future. Not by relaunch again. It's We're just in the beta of this, but that's exciting. So since none of these work, my kids get all these glitters, and I get to buy some new ones. So that's going to be fun. Uh, we also talked more on the mineral makeup. That is something we definitely want to pursue. Um, I have very sensitive eyes, and I can't wear regular store-bought makeup, so I wear mineral makeup exclusively. So we thought we'd like to... Uh, share our line with you guys so we're hoping by fall we'll be able to offer that um, sometime this summer for the uh, nail polishes fall for makeup so 
there we go. This is what we've been busy doing. Don and I have been working really hard on, on the website. When you come to www.dnrapothecary.com on May 28th, you will see a brand new site. It looks nothing like it did before. we got new business cards to go along with it. Um, we're just basically, at this point, we're just making the labels, wrapping the product, and taking pictures. So we're good to go for the May 28th relaunch. We've got 74 different soaps, 32 lip balms. I may make one or two more prior to the relaunch. I'm not sure. Uh, and then the five lip tints. Again, I want more. Just waiting for that shipment of mica. And then the 103 roll-on perfumes. Lotions, we're going to have quite a few of those. Not as many as the soaps because um, some of them will discolor. And, we, you know, that's just grody. You don't want to have brown lotion, so... You know, the list of those will be a lot smaller than the soap, but it'll be a nice, nice mix. So there you go, guys. There's just an update of what we're doing at DNR Path Carry. Thanks so much for watching, and happy Mother's Day. Bye.